Yo guys, what is up? Davis here, and I'm proud to say that I think we have another offline files for kind of like Xenon. Like it's, I'm thinking it's Xenon remade, basically. Um, I'm not sure. My friend, my good friend Antonio, gave these files to me, and uh, I'm online with them right now on my console. And I'm just gonna show you guys how to set it up. Um, I haven't been online with it real long, so I don't know how long it is going to last but I've heard that it is kind of it's just like Xenon it's just remade and it's it's called Edge Offline Files um, this is the folder you guys are going to be downloading um, it's going to have the .xex and it's going to have hb.bin just like um, just like Xenon did and then I, I have a readme so you guys can so you guys know how to set it up and text and all that good stuff so um, First thing, if you're gonna move it to, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it through neighborhood and the USB. So, if we open up neighborhood, <clears throat> this is what you're gonna do. Go to JTAG, retail hard drive, and then these are all the files that I have already. Um, if you do have Xenon, see like I have right here, and then you have the old HB.bin, um, just go ahead and delete those because you don't need them no more and you don't need nothing to be messed up. So delete the old hp.bin, delete xenon, and um, if you don't have those files, then you basically don't want them, so, uh, but basically, we're going to take the edge offline.xex, and we're going to take hb.bin, we're going to drag those two files right there, drag and drop them, as you can see, they're right there, and, um, if you guys have a um, USB, if you're going to do it through USB, this is what you're going to do. You're going to X out of that. Uh, let's see. Go to the, uh, this is my flash drive, so we're going to just move the entire folder to our flash drive. And then after you've done that, I'm going to show you guys what to do on the Xbox now. Alright guys, so now that we're on the Xbox, what we're going to do is we're going to go to Games, My Games, XEX Menu, and you don't need to sign in. And we're going to click RB, and uh, basically you're going to plug in your flash drive right here, and it's going to load up to this screen. Um, you're going to see Edge Offline Files, which is what we want to see. So you're going to click A on that. And then you're going to see Edge Offline.xex. You're going to click Y. And then Copy. And then you're going to press X. And then go to HDD1. Then press Y. And paste. And then press X again. Go back to USB 0. Go down to HB.bin. Press Y. Then press Copy press X go to HDD 1 again and press Y and then paste and we should have offline files and then hv.bin which is good so uh, as you can see we're in HDD dot HDD 1 right now so if we go to we're gonna need to go to dash launch so click A on that go to installer then hit default.xex then it'll load dash launch up and uh, we're going to need to go to plugins so click A on plugins and then we're going to as you can see I already have Xenon right here so just press Y to clear that out if you have Xenon or whatever your stealth server is if you have Inferno it's going to be plugin 2 as well so just clear Inferno out by pressing Y and then we're going to click A on plugin 2 then go to HDD click A on that and then go to uh, Click A on Edge Offline.xex. So click A on that, and then as you can see, we have it set as plugin two. So um, you can minimize plugins by clicking A on it again. And we're gonna click A on Network, and this is exactly how your network should look. Um, usually, if you just set up your Xbox, or if you just got a RGH, it's gonna these two right here are gonna be enabled and basically when you go to test connection it's going to say um, connection failed 
or live is blocked or something like that so basically you need to make sure these two are disabled and not store and ping patch should be enabled so just to clear that up for you guys and all the other ones are disabled as well so these are the only two that should be enabled so after you've done that you're gonna click RB go down to HDD and click X and it'll save it and then basically now we're gonna restart our console It restarted one more time after it booted up, which is normal. Alright guys, so my console's booting up right now. And we should be online. Um I don't think we are. I think I know what I gotta do now. Um you gotta go over to settings and then click on uh, network settings and then click test connection Yeah, so I'm guessing this basically works just like Xenon. Yeah, so we got Edge Offline Success. There we go, guys. So we're online. If we weren't online, then we wouldn't get an update. So it's downloading. This is the Avatar update because this is a brand new hard drive. So, um, yeah, guys, that is, that is the end of this video. Um, I hope you guys learned something from this tutorial. Um, if you guys need me to make a video for something, just hit me up on kick, request a video. Peace out, everyone.